Hello everybody, yeah, the screen's black right now. Today we're going to be creating a resource pack. So, I figured since I do work on my resource pack a lot, um, and then I miss days of uploading, I figured I would just make a kind of not tutorial, but just kind of show you all my processes of making a texture pack or resource pack. Now it's not going to be like a tutorial type thing. This is just going to be kind of me going over uh, what I'm doing. Also, it's like 527 in the morning, so I'm kind of tired. But I woke up this morning. And I decided that I wanted to do the texture pack. I downloaded everything last night and now I'm doing it. So I'm going to make a series out of it also. So that's going to be nice. Uh, this is gonna be a learning experience for me along with I don't know if any of you made resource packs So hopefully you have and you can help me out on this Because I have only used Nova skin and that's like the 1.10 thing But for this I want to use you know like something that isn't 1.10 so I just opened up my pack folder and now we're gonna open up Photoshop. So we're gonna work all the way down the list. So starting at Acacia Bow, ending at uh, Yellow Dye. Possibly some of them I won't even do, maybe. But yeah, that's kind of what this entire series is gonna be. So uh, I don't know how many episodes there will be. We've got a lot to do. So I guess the goal of this is just to have fun with it. See what we can do. And yeah, uh, this will be up to my decision of what I want to make. Obviously, you can add in something. You just spike me, just shoot me a comment, and then I can go over it and look at what appeals to me. Uh, anyway, let's get started on this. All right, we'll just um, <clears throat> start with this. So with me, I kind of want to make the Acacia boat look a little bit more planky. So let me get a look at this thing actually. Uh, can I like zoom? Oh yeah, I can just zoom out a little bit. All right, so let's get a look of where it's not like, all right, it's gonna be pixely, but all right. So it looks like it's not as planky here. So I kind of want to make it a little bit more planky. So what I'm gonna do with that is I'm going to take, uh, we'll take this right here and I'm just gonna, whoa, that's a little too big. And I'm just going to kind of, I guess, go along with this. I don't know. Just make it look planky, if that even makes sense. And then I guess, like, make a lighter color down at the bottom here. So then if I zoom out just a little bit, uh, that looks... Well, it looks planky, that's for sure. Maybe if we just keep going with it, it might look a little bit better. It's like just kind of make it planky like that. What if I like checkerboard it a little bit? God damn it, I'm ruining it already. Uh, it's like, it's five in the morning, making textures, what can go wrong? All right, what if I do like actual pixel size and start zooming in just a little bit? I mean, it doesn't look bad from like this perspective, but then when you get up a little bit more, it looks kind of like, ooh, what did I do? So I guess like maybe I can kind of, I mean, I can use this. This is fine. Uh... <laughs> Oh my god. Alright, what if I like... I don't know, I'm kind of like looking at the ore here. I'm like, hmm, ore. But then I'm kind of like keep it because I know that I'm going to mess that up. So I think we'll just save it. It's the acacia boat.png. And have a nice day. Now let's open our acacia door. And then we'll do the acacia door. So right now it just looks really orange and yeah. So let's make it a little bit darker, I suppose we'll do. So I'll take this 
We'll do a small dark patch like this. So maybe we'll have like a line that goes down from here. And that just makes this area darker. So that's kind of like, and then I guess we can kind of make it on the sides too. And then we'll make it like go down a little bit darker here. And that'll be like the end of the door. And we can kind of make it go over a little bit like that. As for this gray bit here, uh, let's see, as for this gray bit, I think we'll just make it like slightly darker on one end. I think with gray, it's going to look darker. Yeah, so like we'll make it kind of darker there then. Um, as for everything else, I don't really see anything else that we can make it. It's, it's an acacia door. So like, I, I don't really know. We'll just save it then. Acacia door.png. Done. Okay. File open. Let's hit up our Acacia sign. All right. So for the Acacia sign. Hmm. I kind of want to make the text say something else. Or be absent of text. So like if we just have the sign like this. And then what about like just like black and then going like all right you can put something there you can put some oh no no oh, because i already put a sign all right well then you put something there um and we take this back and then put it there it looks hideous <laughs> i guess kind of like having the blank sign is like all right what if i like make it where i have these bits right here and i just make it slightly lighter and then i have it like this, where it's like, oh, here are your lines that you can work with. It doesn't like fully fit. That's the problem. But I can see that working to some degree. <clears throat> so like, I mean, if I had to like this up here, um, the thing about that is I can actually see it kind of working but I think it would look better with just a blank plate here because if you think about it, I'm thinking logically here, the signs don't have any text written on them and that's what's just kind of weird to me. So uh, if we're making slight changes, then I think it would be just better to have it with no text at all. All right then, so open new Apple. Now for the apple, I actually kind of like the apple, but like, I had an idea in mind of something that I wanted to do for the apple. Because I mean, the apple's pretty cool, but like, I want to do something with it. Now like, something I could do is make it like another fruit that go that grows from a tree. Because you don't have like a uh, specific plant that you can like look at. So it's like, this could be anything, this could be a banana, this could be uh, an almond. I don't know really what else grows from a tree. <laughs> I don't even, I think almonds do grow from trees. I, I hope they do. And I just don't sound stupid. Uh... Well, let me look and see where I have my idea for this thing. But I think what we're going to do is we're just going to pop this over and we're going to get rid of it for a second. And then we're going to get our reds. So as of right now, I'll just make it a dark red. Alright, so like, what if we just do like, one, two, three, four, five, and six, one, two, nope, because that's going to be really big for an apple size, because then you get to this, 
and plus would be uneven, so it'd look weird. So like, what if we just do like one, two, three, four, four would look a little bit better, I suppose. I mean, that would be like that, that, and then four. Yeah, and then it would just be like that. And then this would be like the top here, except it would, Apple, I don't know. So like that, and then we would have kind of like the, this is just the rough drawing here. But then we would go to orange because orange can go brown a little bit. So like then we'll have like the stem here. Thank you.
and that concludes the first episode of me creating a resource pack. So, anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed watching me go over and try new things with this thing. So, if you know anything about Photoshop, please tell me tips that could possibly make this more helpful for me. Because this is pretty hard, honestly. Especially tedious. So, yeah. Other than that, I don't really have anything else to say. I'm going to do another episode like this later. And I don't know if I'm going to make this weekly or something. But I want to kind of do a little update every now and then for how I'm doing on this resource pack. So, anyway, that's going to be it for today's episode on this, I guess. And I hope to see all of you in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.